But it's your girl, Anita Gill. Like, share, and subscribe. Y'all, I decided to do a, a video today on these three beautiful young ladies from Jamaica. And I asked myself, why? Because track season about to start for me. And I get a chance to see and officiate a lot of fast, medium speed, just young young lady in sports. Let young ladies in sports has really phased me a lot. They they are into their beauty. They are into their fashion. They're into their expectations, their hopes, their dreams. And they are looking beautiful on the track. And that does a whole lot for me when it comes down to young ladies in sports. Jamaica, Jamaican girls was one of the uh, hardest, toughest girls for the United States this year. And everything, you know, they, they did an awesome job. We had a great, spec, you know, fun and 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 uh whew, work hard to get where we had to go but we're going to talk about jamaica right now not the united states okay i decided to do the stories on these three young ladies because their expectation and hopes and dreams were very high in the uh tokyo games and in the old Olympics. okay right here i got a lot of notes y'all it's so regularly oh man so it's all over the place these three queens <laughs> represent the hopes for so many girls. Their aspect, they, 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 girls, they was hoping that the young ladies would look at them and see how hard they work at practice and uh, they, the expectation and what it takes the, to desire and doing what they had to do to get right here where they are, okay? So that would make other girls push harder to be like, I want to be like Elaine. I want to be like Shelly. I want to be like Sharika. You know, and, and that's that's great, okay? Um, there are so many y'all. They got two set. They got a set of twins in Jamaica, man. They are young. They're teenagers. They are fast, y'all. And so uh, it has a lot to do with training, the way they train, and the way they eat, the way they think, the way they breathe, okay? I know y'all recognize Elaine. Elaine is in the middle. That's Elaine, honey. Look, uh, Elaine showed out in 100 this year. Elaine is one, it's the fastest woman in the world. She's the fastest woman in the world, which Florence Griff Joyner is the fastest girl. But John, uh, Flo Jo is no longer here with us, y'all. But she ran a 10-4 in, uh, um, yeah, John and uh, Florence ran a 10-4 in the 100. Well, um, Elaine ran a 10-5. Not too far, but Elaine is the fastest girl in the world now because Flojo no longer with us. We miss her. Rest in heaven, uh, Flojo. I miss you because I remember you back running in. But now we have a beautiful young lady named Elaine Thompson. Uh, that Hira, Hira, if I pronounce your last name wrong, Elaine, I'm sorry, boo. But, um... Now, Elaine is our fastest girl, y'all. Okay. All right. The fastest girl in the, in the 100. And also, Elaine is 5'6". Okay. Okay. And we got Sharika on our right. Sharika is... God, Sharika, did I get your height? God, I didn't get Sharika height. Oh my God. I'm sorry, Sharika. Sharika, wait, yes, yes. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. No, I didn't. Shelly, I got Shelly height. Shelly height is five feet. Why didn't I get Sharika? Now, this is Shelly, y'all. Shelly is 30. Five years old and still 
fast. And she's supposed to be retiring, y'all. She retired. I don't know if she's going to go back, but she did retire at the Tokyo, uh, at the World Championship um, uh, in 2022 this year. She she retired now. I don't know if she's going to go back. Because one thing about running track is a mental game. If your body said go back, you're going back. So she also... Um, have her masters and everything. So she and a baby. So she might spend time with her family. I don't know. But this is Shelly, y'all. She retired. Yeah, she said she was retiring. So then they got these two fast young ladies. Got some old, you know, Jamaican guy that going on. And they got some great coaches. So, you know, the coaches going to make sure they got what they need to get what they where they want to go. And I just want to... Uh, I just thought about these three young ladies because, you know, the game is about to come up sooner or later. And these young ladies did a tremendous job this year in the Olympics. These three beautiful queens. I just want to congratulate y'all one more time for the United States. And y'all did an outstanding job out there on that track. But well, guess what? We'll be ready for y'all again, okay? United States will be ready for y'all. This your girl, Lanita Gill. Like, share, and subscribe.